Good morning, students of class three. Students, today I'll be continuing with lesson four, Sikkim. Those of you who have got Wordsworth English Reader books, please take out and turn to page number thirty-one. Children, I have already explained two pages. Now, I'll be reading first the lesson once again for you, and then explaining it further. The lesson, Sikkim children, it is in conversation form, conversation between teacher and students, and between two friends, Ria and. Bodhi. When Ria reached her school in the morning, she found a new girl sitting on a seat. Ria smiled and sat next to her. Soon, the teacher entered and introduced the new girl to the class. Teacher, good morning, students. I want to introduce you all. To your new classmate Bodhi. Bodhi belongs to Sikkim, which is one of the most fascinating states of India. Situated in the eastern Himalayas, it spreads below Kanchenjunga, the third highest mountain in the world. Students, hello Bodhi. Welcome to our class. Bodhi, thank you all. Teacher, students. You all have read about some of the states in northeast India. Sikkim is one of them. It is one of the smallest states of India, shaped in the form of a thumb. The state is landlocked. West Bengal, Bhutan, and Nepal are some of its neighbors. Gangtok is the capital and the largest town of Sikkim. The students listen carefully to the new information they had received. Raja, Miss Sikkim must be a beautiful land. Teacher, yes, Raja. In fact, the entire state is hilly and has plenty of forest with wonderful flowers and trees. The main river in the state, the Teesta, flows from north to south. Ann is known as the lifeline of Sikkim. Misha, Miss, what about the animals? Teacher, yes, Misha. Sikkim is also home to some rare animals and birds: the snow leopard, Himalayan black bear, red panda, musk deer, and blue sheep are some of the rare animals found there. Birds like vultures. Eagles, the whistling thrush, bulbuls, pheasants, etc., can also be spotted in the forest. The bell rang for recess. Ria and Bodhi started having lunch together. Ria, hey, what have you brought for lunch, Bodhi? Noodles. Wow, that's my favorite food. Bodhi. Please have it, Ria. What have you brought, Ria? It's aloo ka paratha. Bodhi, please taste it. Hope you will find it delicious. The noodles are also very tasty. Bodhi, thanks, Ria. The aloo ka paratha is very soft and delicious. I really miss my friends in Sikkim. We used to play. In the recess and share our food. Our diet is mainly non-vegetarian. Noodle-based dishes like thukpa, chow mein, wontons, and faktu are common in Sikkim. I really love momos that are served with soup, and they are also one of the most popular dishes in Sikkim. And you know, Ria, we have chang. Which is a famous Sikkim drink. 
it is served in bamboo containers and with bamboo straw riya that's very unique and so eco friendly bodhi yes riya even our houses are very simple they are made from bamboo and lined with cow dung in some places higher on the mountains the houses are made of wood riya bodhi what is sikkim famous for bodhi sikkim is famous for its beautiful arts and craft which include carpets and articles made from woven bamboo you must have heard about sikkim's famous mass dance the people dress up in gaily colored costumes mass swords and sparkling jewels they dance to the sound of drums and the trumpeting of horns riya i am really getting curious about your state sikkim it must be a good place to visit bodhi it is indeed riya though sikkim is a small state but it attracts many tourists people visit sikkim not only to enjoy the view but also for mountaineering trekking river rafting yak safari mountain biking and hand gliding riya my father told me that sikkim got its first airport recently bodhi yes riya it's called the pakyong airport now many more people will be able to visit my beautiful state riya wow bodhi i'm wondering how exciting it would be to visit sikkim so children this was the lesson which i've read and i had explained page number 31 32 and was on page number 33 now children before i move ahead i would again explain page number 1 and uh, 31 and 32 students a new girl named bodhi she is a new student of a class where riya studies the teacher introduces bodhi to the entire class and informs the students that bodhi belongs to sikkim and sikkim is one of the most fascinating states of our country children the geographical location of sikkim is that it is situated where it is situated in india so it is situated in the eastern himalayas it spreads below kanchenjunga the third highest mountain in the world sikkim is situated in the eastern himalayas and it spreads below kanchenjunga the third highest mountain in the world so the children of the class the students of the class they greet bodhi and welcome her to the class riya becomes friends with bodhi then the teacher also tells the student many interesting facts about sikkim she tells them that sikkim is located in the northeast of india and it is one of the eight states who are in the northeast and the shape of sikkim children is like a thumb you can see in the map also the shape of sikkim is like a thumb it is the, the shape of a thumb and sikkim is a landlocked state landlocked means the boundary of sikkim are surrounded by land on all sides no water bodies around so it is a landlocked state and sikkim is one of the smallest states of india and the neighbors of sikkim are nepal west bengal and bhutan these are the three neighbors of sikkim children nepal west bengal and bhutan these are the three neighbors of sikkim then the capital of sikkim is gangtok gangtok is the capital of sikkim and it is the largest town of sikkim then sikkim children is a hilly 
state with plenty of forest and wonderful flowers and trees. And the main river of Sikkim is still in the Tista. Tista is the main river of Sikkim and it flows from the north to south and is also known as the lifeline of Sikkim. The main river of Sikkim is still in the Tista, also known as the lifeline of Sikkim. Then many rare animals and birds are also found in Sikkim, which you cannot see in other parts of the country. And they are, the animals are the snow leopard, the Himalayan black bear, the red panda, the musk deer, the blue sheep. Again, children, the rare animals of Sikkim are the snow leopard, the Himalayan black bear, red panda, musk deer, blue sheep. These are the five rare animals of Sikkim. The snow leopard, Himalayan black bear, red panda, musk deer and blue sheep. And birds which are found in Sikkim are vultures, eagles, the whistling thrush, bulbuls, pheasants. Vultures, eagles, the whistling thrush, bulbul, pheasants. So you need to know the name of the rare animals found in Sikkim. And they are the snow leopard, the Himalayan black bear, red panda, musk deer and blue sheep. And children you can see the picture of red panda over here in the book. And the five birds of Sikkim are vultures, eagles, whistling thrush, bulbuls, pheasant. Besides these there are other birds also but these are the birds which can be seen in Sikkim. Then the food of Sikkim people, children, their diet is mainly non-vegetarian. Sikkim is people are mainly children, non-vegetarian in diet. They try to eat non-vegetarian food. And their uh, dishes are mainly noodle-based dishes and which are known as thukpa, chow mein, wonton, faktu and momos. These are the five main dishes of Sikkim. Thukpa, chow mein, wonton, faktu and momos. And a famous drink of Sikkim is children, chang. A famous drink of Sikkim is chang, which is served in bamboo containers and with bamboo straw. And children, you know that bamboo is very eco-friendly. If you dispose it, if you throw it, it will not harm the environment. So children, this is called eco-friendly. Eco-friendly means which is not at all harmful for the environment. So using bamboo containers, bamboo straws, instead of plastic straws and plastic containers, the, this is eco-friendly. Even we all should think we should use such things which does not harm the environment. So eco-friendly means which is not at all harmful for the environment. Then Bodhi tells Rhea, first she tells Rhea about the food of Sikkim, that Sikkim people are mainly, their diet is non-vegetarian and the main dishes, they are noodles based, known as thukpa, chow mein, faktu, wonton and momos. And chang is a famous Sikkimist drink, which is served in bamboo containers with bamboo straw. They sip it with bamboo straw. Then Bodhi also tells Rhea that the houses of Sikkim are very simple and they are made from bamboo and lined with cow dung. Children, cow dung, as I had explained, जो बेटा गाय का जो गोबर होता है, उससे गांव में घरों को लीपा जाता है और उसको गोबर को इंग्लिश में बेटा what do you call cow dung? तो आन सिक्किम people they make houses with bamboo and line the houses with cow dung and the houses which are located on hills they are made of wood. Now Ria asked Bodhi, what is Sikkim famous for? Now, Ria asked Bodhi, what is Sikkim famous for? <coughs> Bodhi, Sikkim is famous for its beautiful arts and craft which include carpets and articles made from woven bamboo. <coughs> Bodhi tells her, 
दैट सिक्किम इज फेमस फॉर ब्यूटिफुल आर्ट्स एंड क्राफ्ट बेटा बहुत सारे हाथ से बनाया हुआ आर्ट और क्राफ्ट जैसे कि कापेट्स है और आर्टिकल्स वोवन बैम्बू बांस से बीन के बेटा ब्यूटिफुल बहुत फाइनली माइन्यूट सुंदर चीजें बैम्बू से वहां बनती है सिक्किम में एंड पीपल टूरिस्ट हु कम टू विजिट सिक्किम दे ऑफन बाय एज सोवेनियर्स फ्रॉम सिक्किम वो सिक्किम से लेके जाते हैं कि इतना फाइन बैम्बू का काम होता है आर्ट एंड क्राफ्ट की चीजें कि दे टेक देम विद Uh, then when they return from Sikkim, and you must have re- heard about Sikkim's famous mask dance. The people dress up in gaily coloured costume, masks, swords, and sparkling jewels. They dance to the sounds of drums and the trumpeting of horns. Then Bodhi tells Ria that you must have heard about Sikkim's famous mask dance. Beta Sikkim ka mask dance bahut famous hai. Now what do you mean by mask? बेटा मास्क व्हाट डू मीन बाय मास्क मास्क बेटा मुखौटा जो हम चेहरे पे मास्क लगाते हैं मुखौटे को इंग्लिश में मास्क बोलते हैं नाउ इन द पिक्चर यू कैन सी अ सिक्किम इज पर्सन ही इज ड्रेस्ड अप इन ब्राइटली कलर्ड कॉस्ट्यूम बहुत गेली मींस ब्राइटली आप ये देखिए इसका जो कॉस्ट्यूम है इट इज वेरी ब्राइट एंड कलरफुल एंड ही इज वेयरिंग अ मास्क ऑन हिज फेस कैन यू सी दैट ही इज वेयरिंग अ मास्क ऑन हिज फेस and he is having a sword haath mein uske beta sword hai and sparkling jewels sparkling means shining jewelry is wearing so sikkim is people they dance in gaily colored gaily means brightly colored costumes costumes dresses they wear a mask on their face they hold swords in their hands and they wear sparkling jewels sparkling jewels means shiny shining jewels and they dance and they dance to the sound of drums beta jor jor se drums bajte hain and trumpeting of horns horns jaisa horns uh, jaise singing type ka beta kuch instrument hota hai usse jor jor se wo bajate hain aur iske music pe drums and trumpet horns of trumpet ki music pe ye sikkim is people dance karte hain wearing the mask uh, brightly colored dresses holding swords in the hand and wearing uh, shining jewelry so this is a famous dance of sikkim riya i am getting curious about your state sikkim it must be a good place to visit now riya tells uh, bodhi that now as bodhi has uh, told her many things about sikkim so riya is getting curious curious ab riya ko bahut zyada ichha ho rahi ki wo beta kab ja ke sikkim dekh le ha huh? the beautiful hills and uh, mountains of sikkim the rare animals and birds found in sikkim so the simple houses the food of sikkim ye sari cheeze riya ko pata chal gayi now riya wants riya is very curious ki uh, usko bas sikkim ja ke dekhna hai it must be a good place to visit so she asks bodhi riya it must be a good place to visit ki wahan ghumne mein jaane mein to bahut acha lagega who asks uh, this riya asks bodhi bodhi it is indeed riya and bodhi answers riya ki riya bilkul sikkim is indeed a good place to visit though sikkim is a small state but it attracts many tourists now bodhi tells riya that sikkim though it is beta hai to wo bahut chhota se lekin still it attracts lot of tourists why it attracts tourists because of its beautiful art and craft because of its beautiful natural uh, flowers animals birds because of its hilly location isn't it so because of its food so all these things they attract tourists in spite of being a small state many tourists uh, visit sikkim to see the beauty of sikkim people visit sikkim not only to enjoy the view but also for mountaineering trekking river rafting yak safari mountain biking and hand gliding Now Bodhi tells Riya कि ये जो रिया लोग टूरिस्ट जो है वो सिक्किम खाली घूमने और देखने फिरने नहीं आते वो बहुत सारे स्पोर्ट्स भी इंजॉय कर सकते हैं एडवेंचर स्पोर्ट्स एडवेंचर स्पोर्ट्स जैसे कि माउंटेनियरिंग वॉट यू मीन बाई माउंटेनियरिंग 
क्लाइंबिंग द माउंटेन वहां पे माउंटेन की हाइट को वो स्केल करते बहुत सारे क्योंकि आपने अभी जैसे कि हमें पता है कि अभी सिक्किम ईस्टर्न हिमालय में सिचुएटेड है एंड इट्स फेस बिलो कंचनजुंगा द थर्ड हाइएस्ट माउंटेन इन द वर्ल्ड तो वहां पे लोग जाते हैं सिक्किम में एडवेंचर स्पोर्ट्स के एंजॉय करने के लिए लाइक माउंटेनियरिंग माउंटेनियरिंग इज क्लाइंबिंग द माउंटेन्स और वहां पे लोग माउंटेन्स पे क्लाइंब करते हैं एंड ट्रैकिंग व्हाट यू मीन बाय ट्रैकिंग बेटा आप पैदल चल के लंबी जर्नी स्पेशली डेजर्टेड एरियाज में हिल्स में फॉरेस्ट में वॉक करके जाना एंड नेचुरल ब्यूटी को देखना बाय वॉकिंग ऑन फुट दैट इज नोन एज ट्रैकिंग देन रिवर राफ्टिंग ये भी एक बेटा बहुत एडवेंचर स्पोर्ट है इसमें राफ्ट पे राफ्ट स्मॉल लाइक बोट लाइक स्ट्रक्चर अब बट इट इज नॉट मेड ऑफ वुड ये बेटा कुछ फाइबर टाइप का कुछ उससे बना होता है एंड ये रिवर की बहुत हाई करंट्स में आपको लाइफ जैकेट पहन के बैठना पड़ता है एंड देन यू रियली एंजॉय द फन वाइल डूइंग रिवर राफ्टिंग देन याक सफारी याक आपको पता है माउंटेन्स में याक एक गाय के टाइप का एनिमल होता है जो बहुत जहाँ पे कोल्ड रीजन होता है जनरली वहां पे ये होता है या कैन बी फाउंड इन नेपाल आल्सो है ना सिक्किम ये हिली एरियाज में ज्यादा होता है बेटा और याक सफारी याक पे बैठ के और फॉरेस्ट में घूमना जहाँ पे एनिमल्स को उनके नेचुरल हैबिटेट में देखना एनिमल्स बेटा जैसे कि हम जू में जाते हैं तो जू में तो एनिमल्स एनक्लोजर्स में केजेस में बंद होते हैं बट आप सफारी जब करते हैं तो आप सीधे सेंचुरीज है या फॉरेस्ट है उनमें जाते हैं और आप एनिमल्स को उनके नेचुरल सराउंडिंग्स में आराम से घूमते हुए आ, देखते हैं नेचुरल उनके हैबिटेट में और ये याक सफारी मतलब याक पे बैठ के हम फॉरेस्ट में जाके एनिमल्स को देखेंगे दैट इज नोन एज याक सफारी देन माउंटेन बाइकिंग माउंटेन पे बाइक चलाना माउंटेन बाइकिंग इज माउंटेन पे बाइक चलाना दिस अगेन इज एन एडवेंचर स्पोर्ट एंड देन हैंग ग्लाइडिंग वॉट इज हैंग ग्लाइडिंग आप ग्लाइड करोगे एक ऐसा रॉड टाइप रहता है और ऊपर ऐसे विंग्स ऐसे रहते हैं यू नीड टू होल्ड द योर दैट रॉड विथ योर हैंड्स एंड देन यू हैंग ऑन इट आप उस पर लटक जाते हो और फिर आप किसी हिल या किसी उस पर दौड़ के यू नीड टू जम्प एंड देन यू स्टार्ट ग्लाइडिंग ऑन द इन द एयर ठीक है आप उससे दौड़ोगे हिल से एंड यू नीड टू जम्प एंड वेन यू जम्प वो उसके जो विंग्स हैं दैट मेक्स यू ग्लाइड इन द एयर यू आर हैंगिंग एंड ग्लाइडिंग इन द एयर विद द हेल्प ऑफ द विंग्स दैट इज हैंग ग्लाइडिंग सो टूरिस्ट को ये सारे एडवेंचर स्पोर्ट्स जो बेटा किस स्टेट में है सिक्किम में एंड वॉट आर द एडवेंचर स्पोर्ट्स which tourists can enjoy in sikkim mountaineering trekking river rafting yak safari mountain biking and hang gliding these are some of the adventure sports which also attracts tourists so the adventure sports which tourists enjoy in sikkim are mountaineering trekking river rafting yak safari mountain biking and hang gliding Ria, my father told me that Sikkim got its first airport recently. Then Ria tells Bodhi that my father has informed me that recently, बहुत जल्दी ही अभी Sikkim को एक नया airport वहाँ पे start हो गया. Bodhi, yes, Ria, it's called the Pakyong Airport. Now many more people will be able to visit my beautiful state. Then Bodhi says, yes, Ria, कि अभी जो नया airport Sikkim में अभी स्टार्ट हुआ एंड दैट इज पाक्योंग एयरपोर्ट द नेम ऑफ द एयरपोर्ट इज बेटा पाक्योंग एयरपोर्ट पी ए के वाई ओ एन जी पाक्योंग एयरपोर्ट द नेम ऑफ द ओनली एयरपोर्ट इन सिक्किम इज चिल्ड्रन पाक्योंग एयरपोर्ट और अब एयरपोर्ट बन गया है तो और लोग एयर एयर से भी ट्रैवल करके सिक्किम घूम सकते हैं सो दैट दे कैन सेव टाइम ट्रैवलिंग बाय एयर सेव टाइम इज इट 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 टेक्स टाइम बाय ट्रैवलिंग ऑन रोड एंड by train riya wow bodhi i'm wondering how exciting it would be to visit sikkim so now riya tells bodhi ki i'm really wondering ki kitna exciting hoga sikkim ko visit karke wahan pe enjoy karna now children we have learned a lot about sikkim from this lesson let's revise what all we have learned first 
um, let's see where Sikkim is situated. Children, it is situated in the eastern Himalayas and it spreads below Kanchenjunga, the third highest mountain in the world. This is the geographical location of Sikkim. Then Sikkim is uh, one of the northeast states of our country and children, it is in the shape of a thumb and it is landlocked. Sikkim is a landlocked state and it is also one of the smallest state of our country and neighbors of Sikkim are West Bengal, Bhutan and Nepal and what is the capital of Sikkim? Name the capital of Sikkim. So Gangtok is the capital of Sikkim and Gangtok is also the largest town of Sikkim. Then uh, the main river of Sikkim, name the main river of Sikkim which is also known as the lifeline of Sikkim. So the, the lifeline of Sikkim is the T-star. The lifeline of Sikkim is the T-star. T-star is the lifeline of Sikkim. Also it flows from north to south. Then some of the rare animals and birds of Sikkim, the animals are the snow leopard, Himalayan black bear, red panda, musk deer and blue sheep. These are some of the rare animals found in Sikkim. Then some birds also we can see like vultures, eagles, the whistling thrush, bulbuls, pheasant. These are the birds which can be commonly spotted in Sikkim. Then the diet of Sikkim people children are is mainly non-vegetarian. Sikkim is people like to eat mainly non-vegetarian food and their dishes are noodle based. Matlab sub dishes mein beta noodles hota hai. And some famous dishes of Sikkim are thukpa, chow mein, wontons, faktu and momos. These are some famous Sikkimist dishes. And then the famous Sikkimist drink is children, Chang. Chang is the famous Sikkimist drink. Then the houses of uh, uh, Sikkim are very simple. They are made with bamboo and lined with cow dung. And the houses on mountains, they are made of wood. And uh, children, Sikkim happens to be a very eco-friendly state. Why? Because they don't use, Sikkimist people generally use bamboo containers, bamboo straw, which all these things are eco-friendly not at all harmful for the environment. Then, the, what is Sikkim famous for? Sikkim is famous for its beautiful arts and crafts, which include carpets. Carpets hote hai na, beta? Carpets jo floor pe bichhate hai, bhoat sundar carpets bante hai Sikkim mein. And articles made from woven bamboo. Woven matlab beta, haat se unko bun ke banaya jata hai. Jaise aapki mami uh, sweater haat se knit karti hai, vaise hi Tokriya haat se banate hai, vaise hi, jase baas ki tokri banti, vaise hi bhoat sundar sundar weave karke bamboo ke articles banate hai Sikkim mein. Then Sikkim's famous mask dance, jo mask behen ke dance karte hai. Sikkim's people, they wear a mask, they dress up in brightly colored costumes, dresses, they hold swords, swords matlab talwar, wo swords pakarte hai and they wear sparkling jewels and then they dance to the sound of drums and trumpeting of horns. Then the uh, Sikkim uh, has got many adventure sports to, which attracts tourists. Or kon kon se adventure sports se jo tourists ko attract karte hai? Mountaineering, trekking, river rafting, yak safari, mountain biking and hang gliding. These are some of the adventure sports which attracts tourists to Sikkim. The adventure sports are mountaineering, trekking, river rafting, <coughs> yak safari, mountain biking and hand gliding. Then Sikkim has recently got an airport and the name of the airport in Sikkim children is Pakyong Airport. What is the name of Sik the airport of Sikkim? Answer would be Pakyong Airport, P-A-K-Y-O-N-G, Pakyong Airport. I hope children the lesson is clear to you.
Now we also know a lot about Sikkim. Now if anyone asks something about Sikkim, we'll be able to answer a lot of things that we have learned from this lesson.